Hey guys, this video is going to be an in-depth explanation of movement in Tarkov. The main points I'll be discussing today are What is movement? Why is movement important? What kind of movement is good and bad? How to optimize your movement? And how to move well in gunfights? So the first point is what is movement? Movement in Tarkov is your ability to rotate, you know, here and there, path your raid, so like if I have spawned let's say in over there, I want to path my raid from that area where my laser is, go up the stairs to office, loot the safe etc, loot the shelves here, go down the stairs over here or the outside stairs, I would prefer to go down maybe these stairs or you could probably go down these out, these out ones but it doesn't matter, out these stairs, down, around and out to extract. That is, a, that is your pathing path of movement. Pathing path is essential because essentially, if if you don't have a path goal, yeah, if you don't, if you don't make you don't if you don't make a path for yourself, you're gonna be at much higher risk of basically n not being being caught off guard, yeah. And if you're caught caught off guard in your raid, you're, you're less likely to live. You know, it, it's a game. It's an FPS. It's an FPS that, that, that is based off your reaction rate when in gunfights and rotating and the like. It's, it's just what it is, you know? If you have sh pathing, you're gonna die quicker probably. And use of cover. Your use of cover is also really important. Let's say, I'll go out I'll go out here for example. No, where the, where, 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 I'm stupid. I don't even know factory, I'm stupid. Let's say you're out here, yeah? You're out here in the open. Right here. Walking to extract. Right, like this. You're not using any cover. You, you, can, you can be shot from there. You can be shot from just there, where my blue laser is. You can be shot from over there. You can be shot from in here, probably. He'll peek out and shoot you. You can be shot from the doorway, that doorway, in there. You, 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 it's just it's just dumb. Why are you out here, kind of thing, you know? A better way to path yourself, if you're coming from, let's say, over there, use the barrels and stuff, you know? Come around. Then go behind here, run behind here. If you need to save up stamina, again, save up stamina behind here. You can't be shot unless it's maybe from up there or like someone up there. Or like maybe up there. You you're covered, you know? And then it go to extract, you know? And you, you don't want to sit out here for too long, yeah? The only reason why you'd be out here for long is if there's rats in here, like extract camping. But even then, if you know there's only one rat at the end here and he picks you once and he gets a few shots off, run it, like, do your best, bait another shot, do, and then go in, right here, yeah? Use of cover, and then come around here, or do what you want, you know, go around this side, if he's around this side. Your use of cover is extremely important while moving to, out the map, yeah? Just going going in and out of cover. Really important. Why is all of this movement important now? Why is it important? Well, if you really have, if I have to answer this question for you, you know, you're obviously an FPS newbie, which is alright. That's why this video is here. This movement is important so you don't die. You don't want to die in this game. It, it, it's called Escape from Tarkov. It's not called Kill Things and Die in Tarkov. It's called Escape from Tarkov. This move, if you want to actually like have a higher survival rate, even a KD, your your movement will improve that significantly. If you have trash movement throughout the map, you're gonna die so many much more often. In comparison, if you have good movement and using cover, going around barrels, going around containers, going in and out of doors, you know, like this. If you're actually optimizing your movement while trying to get to extract, it's much harder for people to shoot you. If you're going in and out of buildings, around things, you know, it's much harder for a sniper to get you, much harder. Like if I'm just, let's say, let's say there's someone up, up there, you know, just theoretically up there where my blue laser is right now. And I'm walking this way. He can just shoot me. He has like 15... The 20 seconds of e and I'm walking in a straight line. It's easy to die to shoot me, yeah? Now let's give another example. Moving like this is a better is better movement. That's better. Is, is it the best? No. Because you're still out in the open. You're, you're still out in the open waiting for that sniper to shoot you up there, you know? You're, you're still going bam, bam, bam. You know what? You can, and if you're going... The, the goal also, let's say you're here, you're going to that extract, yeah? And you're just, you're just doing this. You're out in the open, yeah? So back to, back to the point I was trying to make. Rather than going out here, yeah? A better movement path immediately, immediately. Obviously zigzagging. And then bam, in here. He, he has half the time to shoot you. Half. 
L literally half. Yeah? And now let's do another example. That's better movement. Now the best movement you could do in this situation would be that. You know, maybe it, it takes you longer to get the extract, but he, he almost has no chance of shooting you. He might have like half a millisecond of seeing your head. Maybe a second. Yeah? He, he might he can't see you behind these. You know, he might take a shot behind these and hit you, but it's going to be much, much harder for him. But if you maybe want to be a bit quicker and you're willing to risk um, a bit of time, which I wouldn't do, go go through this door immediately, you know? Open it, back up this way or something, do a big circle, back in, you know? Jump. That, 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 that is why movement is important and that these are examples of what bad movement is and what good movement are, yeah? Now, how to optimize your movement. This is a bit of a tricky one because in regards to trying to optimize your movement, um, it, it mainly comes with playing the game more, you know? Let's say, um, okay, no, 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 that's it. Come back down here. If you're running around on your map, you know, and you're just, you're just running around, bla like, no goal, nothing, you're just going blah, 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 like this, you know? Y you're not optimizing your movement whatsoever. At least if you're thinking about your movement, yeah? Even if you don't have a specific path in red, you know, you, you, you're just going around things, through things, etc. This, this is just an, an example of much better movement. You're next to cover, yeah? You're next to areas where if, if there's someone here trying to peek you, you can and they peek you and you're about here, you can immediately go in here, you know? That, that's better movement. While, let's say, you're a bit more in the middle out here, you know? It takes you, a, it, there's about half a second longer he, he has to shoot you, you know? Sticking close to things, just thinking about your movement, thinking about where you are, will optimize your movement. And it doesn't come immediately, no. That's why the more you play the game, the better you are going to get at your movement. You know? Like, right now, th th that was bad. Like, out here, sitting out here, not the best idea, you know? A better idea would be coming up along here and using this and going along this, you know? It it's not the best if you have to go from over there to over here. You know, it's not the best, but it's better than being, like, out here, three meters from the wall. You know, it's better. Is it, is it, why is it better? Well, because at least if someone's over there, you have a little bit of cover. And if someone's over there, yeah, it's a bit harder, you know? It's a bit harder to escape that. But at least you can come maybe over here if they're a little bit more on the um, that far left side. And at least if you're over here and they're over there, at least you can get behind here, you know? You're optimizing your movement so that it's harder for everyone to shoot you. That is what movement is in Tarkov. Optimizing your your ability to go around the map so that both scavs and players have a harder time shooting you. That's it. So thank you guys. Thank you guys for sticking around and watching if you did. And I uh, hope to see you in the next time. Bye guys.